The machine is ready, Miss Nikos. Headmaster, are, are you sure there's no other way? Why are you even considering it? Yep. Yeah. Idiot. 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 Bit of an accent. I, I can't feel him any longer. He's... He's... I'm sorry, Miss Nikos, but there is no uh, more time for doubts. Jean is gone. Do you really think... Uh, do you really want to add to the corpse pill? It's exactly because I want to keep it from going higher that, that I... We've tried for months to think of a way to save Amber. Bring her back to us with no success. All she is right now, essentially, in the circumstances, is a target. He's lying! You know he's lying! That doesn't really matter right now. I understand. And I agree that her powers would be of better use if they were transferred to someone who's actually capable of moving. I should have been there. I should have been with him. Why wasn't I there? Then what's stopping you? Deathbed or not, we are about to kill someone, Headmaster. I want to know if uh, it's not going to be for nothing. Peter, you can't. Think of what Jin would say. What John, Nora, and Ren... Jin is gone. His blood is on my hands. What does it matter if I hurt what another one of his friends in the process? I'm already a monster. Okay, so that may be a slight downside to Pierre being so close to it is, um... She's just... Well, uh, this result is going to happen anyway. Basically, if you aren't close to Pierre, she would just accept the offer because she doesn't know about Amber. If you're not close to Pierre, then... You know, uh, yeah. Wait, uh, yeah. If you're close to Pierre, she will accept the offer now and think she's a monster for doing it. If you're not, then she'll accept the offer, not knowing about uh thingy, and she, you know, she. Oh God! The results are gonna end up the same. It's just one way Pierre feels a lot worse about herself. A secret entrance, but how? Of, of course. Who else? And would. Wow. Maybe it's better this way. Someone like me is just dead weight. A minor character in someone else's story. I feel that everything I've ever tried. All this power and what did I do with it? Miss Nikos, I assure you that I will do everything in my power to make the process go smoothly. You will become the next Fall Maiden. I wanted to see the world and I got killed. I received a second opportunity at, th at life thanks to him. I made friends. I couldn't even repay their kindness and selflessness. I'll hold you to that, my headmaster. Still, I made a promise, didn't I? No. No, 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 no. Time to wake up, Amber! <laughs> I couldn't be the throne because he made me promise. He made me promise I'd think about protecting myself above everything else. I couldn't save him. But I'll be damned if I break that promise. Of course. If you please climb inside the machine now. I won't let you do this, Pira. Uh, I can't move. Miss Nikos, what? Oh! You just lost everything, Osbin. Amber? You... All your petty words, all your efforts for the greater good. If I hadn't liquefied that arrow in midair, it'd all be for naught. Someone wasn't paying attention to the door. You, how? Jin. You cannot be serious. She's going to be sick of hearing that name by now. <laughs> oh, but I am. I wouldn't be uh, in front of you right now. If it hadn't been for him and his friends. Managed to land you in quite the predicament, hmm? Me still able to defend myself and you without your cronies. Among other things. Oh, so would Mercury and Emerald be with her right now if they hadn't been murdered by Neo? Or would they be doing something else? Would this be a three on three? Clash or... Ah. Miss Fall, I suggest you surrender. You... You're the reason why. Tch. Poor little thieving tart. All those plans, all of that effort, all the gambles and the lives you stepped on for naught. 
All because one person cared enough to talk to me. Don't move. It's over. I'll show you over. You think this is it? You think I'm going to just lay down and surrender? So you can throw me in some dingy cell and interrogate? I don't think that's what they're going to do with you, Cinder. <laughs> I don't think that's the plan at all. I think it's more surrender and they'll make your death a bit swifter. <laughs> I'll swallow my tongue before that. You'll have to kill me if you want to stop me. I think that was their plan. They just wanted to do it easily. That can be arranged. End of line, Cinder. If that is even your real name. And you know the craziest thing? What you did to me? The pain, the humiliation. The violation of my body and soul. I despise you on a level that I never thought I'd be able to. I truly hate you. I wonder what this event would be like if you'd done all Cinder's dates and went to the dance with her. <laughs> like... Because that's an option. Well, it's not an option. You can't go to the dance with Cinder, but like, eventually it might be an option. I wonder how the story would change in turn, though, if um, I did a lot of stuff with Cinder. I didn't wonder if that would change things. I thought of so many ways to make you suffer and pay for what you did to me before ending it. The resentment has been with me for as long as I could reflect on it. And yet. You want to go with Star, Princess? You're not the first person. You certainly won't be the last. And yet, right now... All I want is to ask you a question. Are you able to take away the rest of my powers without killing me? Amber, I don't think that's a very good idea. Um, Amber, what are you doing? What do you, what do you mean? Amber? Exactly what I said, you dim with his soul. Are you able are you able or not? I see. Yes. Yes I am. She could be lying! Like Why no bad You think that's enough? Convince me. What? What is Amber, what are you doing? Well I'm not uh, well it's not as toxic as say for an aura. The power of a maiden still aren't uh, something you're born with. They're something you received, and as such, they're not part of your body or soul makeup. Removing them without harming the host is absolutely possible. Explain the first time, then. I, Amber, I imagine she just wanted to kill you the first time. The reed and the oak, princess. You must let the storm pass over you instead of resisting it. Oh, so, like... Because Amber didn't accept the power getting took, like, it, uh, it basically tore a chunk of her soul, in a sense, as well, or chunked out a part of her as well. Right, okay, that theoretically could make sense. But also, I just assumed Cinder wanted her dead anyway. So, in short, as long as you actually do want to relinquish your powers, my methods can't harm you. Interesting. That is acceptable. Amber? You, you can't be serious. Do you realize who you're siding with? She tried to kill you. She's responsible for the breach and for what happened right now in Ami. Beacon and Vale. There's countless blood in her hands, including Jin's. She's the reason he's dead. All of this to get your powers and now you're just going to give them to her? Yes. Because she's also, ironically, the person who doesn't want to kill me right now. Oh! She made a promise with Jin! That she would value her life above everything else. So at this point, she just wants to ditch the powers and bug her off. And, like... Uh, can you blame her? <laughs> like, okay, you're giving the powers to Cinder. Terrible idea. But equally, a minute ago, these two wanted you dead. Like, Pyrrha was willing to kill Amber a minute ago. She just accepted that that was an okay thing. And this twat has been planning to kill her for ages. Even though it you, she could get better. Because, oh, she might be corrupt. Which, Amber, by the way, you're not helping that situation. Like, he thought you might be corrupted and stuff because of all the stuff happened to you. And you got repaired out of nowhere. And then all of a sudden you wake up and you're giving your powers away. It does It's not a good look, Amber! Yes, that kind of... <laughs> this is absolutely hilarious. Oh, God. You... You'd be so selfish. Then Jin's death doesn't mean anything to you. On the contrary, it's exactly because of him. 
that I'm swallowing my pride and making a deal with the devil here. I could... I could have saved him. And yet I didn't have the opportunity. Because I wasn't there. I wasn't there because he asked me to protect myself. To value my life. My survival. More than anything else. Jin wanted me to live. He died protecting others. He could feel it as he... I could feel it as he went. I'll honour his wishes and do anything in my power to survive. Ah! You can see where she's coming from, but still! And believe me, Pierre, you're not a worse person. Uh, uh, there's not a worse person that could be entrusted with uh, ensuing someone else's safety than Osbin. Oh, you don't know the half of it. That's the entire reason he's doing all of this. You... you know? Hmm? Headmaster? Yes, I do. She was sending me to face her enemy, after all. But when you face an enemy, it's important to know all the weak points. But, uh, be they in body, the mind... Or the heart. What's going on here? He got, like, a heart condition or something? Or are we talking about the relationship stuff between him and Salem? Like, figures of literally heart. What? You won't be leaving this place alive, Miss Fall. Now, this should be interesting. The Fall Maiden versus the Headmaster of Beacon. Sort of. Don't forget about me. No, Miss Nikos. You need to can, uh, serve your energy, and in case something happens to you, I can't risk your life. I mean, if he plans to kill her, best it case scenario, her power then transfers into Pyrrha. But Headmaster, you said... I'm indeed weakened, Miss Nikos. Still... Still pretty strong, isn't he? He's got magic on his side. Not a lot, but he's got magic on his side. Also, we learned what that cane does. Or, some of what that cane does. Uh, but I, I, I doubt the cane thing's implemented into this. But anyway... And still more than enough to deal with two misbehaving children. Right, hold on. Just going to quickly save. Um, yeah, yeah, we'll just save over that one there. Because um, things are about to go bad. What? What has happened? I? The sound, the air, it's like... This is the world of my semblance. You had your chance to listen and comply. Instead, you chose to make it hard on yourselves. Very well, then. Hold on, it's always been pulling a Dio. I will accommodate you. Oh, we're fighting Osbin as Cinder in... Okay, right then. Well, 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 well. Okay, I'm going to focus as Amber, and like, I'm just going to attack as Cinder, then. Refraction, Magical Thunder, Magical Ice, Magical Fire. Magical Thunder! Ah, it didn't do a lot. Okay, semblance either. What does that do? Refraction. What do they mean? Oh, okay, so that doing, uh, did damage back to him. I need to, keep, I need to keep healing as well in case um he does like a big move that like just kills me or something. Oh, that did plenty. That did less. I was not expecting with this. I'm... We're literally... We're playing as Amber and Cinder fighting Ospin. <laughs> how did this happen? <laughs> I'm just sitting thinking about it. I'm like, how, how did we end up here? Okay, that does a lot. What about a bow? Ah, the bow does more with Cinder. Makes sense. Makes sense. Right. You're just going to attack because you didn't get hit. You're going to heal. We're both going to heal now. And we're both going to use our either power and refraction. Okay, so refraction with Cinder means that basically if something hits Cinder, it damages the user back as well, it seems. I don't know if that's what either... I don't know what either does. If that's the same deal or what. Attack. Focus. Keeping nice and healthy. I'm expecting Osbin to pull something mental out of his bag, and that's that worries me. Magical fire. Ooh, whoa, oh, that did a lot. 
the magical ice. No, no, no. Cinder's not too into that. Oh, God. Amber's a bit dead. Um, fraction. Focus. Right, we're back at full. Uh, wait, so Amber is, seems to be better with the old magic. Never mind. Wait, oh, it's just one is one thing better than others? Like, what, is Magical Fire just more effective on Osman? Uh, I'm not sure. Ice. Okay, let's actually see what that did there. Um... Yeah, that did bugger all. Fraction. His aura cover has thinned out now. Hmm. Oh, oh, oh. Oh! You're about to say there was no need to kill him. Seriously, though, was that really the uh the extent of your his prowess? All he did was beat us with that stick of his... I'm not that naive, but you could have chosen a uh, less gruesome way. Oh, believe me, it's better this way. Right through the uh, right eye. He didn't even have time to register what happened. Now, shall we? Before that promise, you won't kill Pira too. Hmm, why not? I'm feeling pretty generous, Con... You know, we're still in the time stop world, right? Yeah, I was about to say, like, we're still in this world, like... If you've killed him, why is this power still going? Wait a minute. Why are we still here? Excuse me? Why is everything still frozen? If this was caused by semblance, why isn't it back to normal? That's true. Maybe... Maybe you shouldn't assume you've won yet. Uh oh. Just did a little quick save really quickly. <laughs> Phase 2 has begun! Ha what? This is... Uh, did you seriously just pull that out? A generation semblance then? No, probably more like reversing time. I'm not sure. If it's just regeneration, what happened to the sur our surroundings? Ow! Hell! Hey there! Refraction! Heal, 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 heal. Close. Okay, so that still does tons. That doesn't drain our energy either. That seems to be like one of the best things we can do. We heal. We attack. Okay. Yeah, I think I think just going for the basic attacks not as maybe the best method. Like the other stuff can work, but I'm not sure how it works. Like, cause some days it seems to do tons, and other times it seems to do very little. But but close ranged heal 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 heal. Hell for it. Go for your. Oh, that's costly. But, but, this time, we're doing something different. Focus on my spell and enhance it. T fine. Oh, oh, oh. Have you blown us into bits this time? Room certainly seems a bit brighter. I like your style. There's nothing to like. I just turned a man into a pile of charcoal. I'm just glad that Pierre wasn't affected somehow, and... This is beginning to feel a bit weird. Nothing... Nothing's changed. It... It can't be. Begin phase three! <laughs> I'm... Impossible. This is impossible. Oh, he's hitting harder! I think. I'm actually sure. Luckily, we heal really good, so we're alright. Um, oh, hello. 
Well, okay, no, do the fraction first because that's just handy. Then we go for Magical Thunder. And now what does this do? Not very really much as it turns out. Um, Heal, heal. What about Magical Fire? Fire's seen the more effect on him before. Yeah, that does a bit. But then it's like, or my physical literally does the same. Yeah, like... Hold on. Heal. 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 Then... Yeah, like, the physical attack just... Do no, okay, that's weakened. Uh, maybe either is a good idea. Hold on. Use it. And... Fraction. I'm not really sure what it does. I'm hoping it just powers things up, to be honest. Yeah, after I use either, my physical attack seems to get stronger. So if I use Empower, will that Empower up Amber and make her hit even harder? No, okay. Focus, focus, focus. The worrying part is, if Oz been targeted just the one person kept beating them down and didn't split his focus between the two of them, he'd totally win. <laughs> Why does he use range with Amber? No, I'll get into this much. Yeah! They're both trying their hardest! And he's back again! And again! <laughs> oh my god! He's wearing them down! No, 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 no! How does he keep getting back up? Will you calm down already? Damn amateur. This is how I managed to get you in the first place. He's not invincible, nor is he unkillable, believe me. If this is, is because of his semblance, it means it consumes aura. You're... you're right. That's why he only attacks us with his weapon, to conserve aura. So theoretically, if we keep killing him, he can run out of aura, yes. So fight carefully and stop wasting energy on big attacks. I can already feel the aura... In the air, uh, either starting to thin out. And what if we run out first? Then we're dead. Shut up and fight. Okay, well, we've done that bit then. Right, so Cinder and Amber are teaming up to fight Osbin. Osbin's uh, semblance is just full on time manipulation in this, which oh, we're not really. In the show, it seems to imply that some type of timey thing might be it. Because he certainly had some type of acceleration thing going on, but we don't know if that's his semblance or just magic. And even then, we don't know if it's, like, really what how far it goes. Either way, he's just went above and beyond. He's just pulling a full deal at this point. Like, he literally... Okay, he's technically reversing time, but, like, deal regenerates. And then, time stop. And then, yeah, okay, it's not exactly the same thing, but, like... God damn, it's strong! Right! God... On to the L and other things then, I suppose. Well, that all's happening on down below. Da, 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 da. Also, just want to say a quick thank you to all of the channel members for the extra support. And a special thank you and shout out to our elite members, the Johnny members, Austin Quinzenberry, Afro Kagi, It's Ender Steve P.E., Sebastian Ramsey, and Blackest Sage. And our Anbu members, Robert Saimeka, Rapid Zrug, Aragon, Gold Dragon, Nathaniel Pru, Akuma, and Colton Wood. Thank you all very much for the extra awesome support. Butter, butter, butter.